right now it's about 6 45 in the morning boys and i decided to go fishing so we're going to skyway pier this is the right by the bridge that connects st pete's to the mainland pretty cool fishing spot i believe that's a state park also you gotta pay to get in so i don't think you need to have a license to fish there Anyway, I'm not much of a fisherman, but the plan for today, we've got to try to catch a grouper. I know it's a high shot, but you got to have some plans. <laughs> so that's what we're going for. One adult, two kids. Okay, to get in here, it's four dollars per vehicle, four dollars per adult, I think two dollars per kid. So we got some bait. This might be a little too big. You ready to do it? There. Closer. So. So you feel it swimming. You can just cross it over there because the current is that one. Also, go under the lake. because it's like 20 degrees cooler in here than it is outside.
Heads up. Fire. Jen. Hello. What do you do? It looks like these are the only two kind of these guns. They're like cannons. Yeah, two kinds. Well, this is the only kind. There's, there were more of these guns, but this is the only two in the fort. And they're uh, kind of old, and they can penetrate a ship's deck. It, like in six, if it's a ship is like six miles away, it could penetrate six inches of steel. Woo! That's pretty good. And these, they were never filed, fired in battle, only on test practice. This is Fort DeSoto. It's near St. Pete's in Florida. Actually, it's right by Skyway Bridge where we went fishing with the boys. Real small fort. It was built in early 1900s. It was used during Spanish-American War. Uh, has some pretty cool guns. They were never really shot uh, in battle. They were only tested. This is not a state park, so your state park pass will not work. And the entrance fee is $5 for parking. And there's beautiful, beautiful beaches here and pier and all that stuff. So it's pretty hot. We're going to go to the beach <laughs> and enjoy the water. Water is real nice and warm. It's beautiful. Really? Stop scratching. Sorry. <laughs> like everything's biting. Just south of us is Anna Maria, one of our favorite beaches in Florida. Uh, so we really like this area. Haven't been here yet, but we're checking it out today. We're going to go to the... We're gonna go swim. That's why we're here in the summer. We're gonna get because otherwise there's no reason to be in Florida in the summer. <laughs> the bugs are brutal and the heat is crazy. And I'm not complaining. It's pretty hot, but that's exactly how we like it. We wanted to stay here for the summer. The water is amazing. <laughs> Poor bed is like dripping sweat. <laughs> I'm dying. Sweating. Water is amazing. It's hot. It's hot? What do you think? 80 some degrees? No, it's down. <laughs> no, it's probably 80 something. I said it'll drip. I say it's about 84 degrees. We're going to look it up later, but crazy warm. Because it's really, really clear. It's beautiful.
open yet. There's barely anyone here. Like, really, no people. Yeah, that's really Amazing. Nice. Beach is nice. It's pretty shallow. You can walk far. Let's see if we can spot some good fish here. Fort DeSoto was great. I really liked it. There is not many people. We just drove up a little bit north of it. And there is so much parking. There is parking lot galore here. Um, I've seen even a bunch of people parked with their RVs. And it looks like a really nice beach. They actually have lifeguards and everything. Well, Benny cut his foot <laughs> with some sharp shells. So it kind of quit the beach and uh, we're gonna go to the Skyway Bridge uh, to the pier and try fishing again. We tried that a few days ago uh, just me and the boys and we didn't exactly catch anything but I guess the tide probably wasn't right because normally people catch there a lot of fish. There is a pier here and there is a lot of fish here too and we've seen some kid, kid catch a snook. Um, so yeah so we're gonna try that. See how it goes. That's a really nice one. <laughs> Tim. Ah, it's bigger than you, That's what fishing is. It's a real lesson in patience. For me. <laughs> you wait and you see what happens. You never know. Mommy really wants some fish. Mommy really wants some fish. Go walk away. A fish. <laughs> so try this again tomorrow.